by you coming here today to rally with respect to this, what you're really showing is a is a resolve that you're not going to let this hurricane wash away your dreams, it's not going to blow away your dreams, but a resolve that you're going to stick together and try to get this place rebuilt, and part of that sticking together against your own insurance company. Now, and, and, and it's important that you're here to show this. Most of, the, most of the coastal communities that I go to throughout the United States, it's got to start somewhere. And so when Dolores and Joey ask, can you do something more than just represent us, can you help try to organize an effort to let people know and share information so that we can get evidence of the amount of wind damage that actually happened. Everybody keeps talking about the amount of wave damage that happened, but there's a lot of wind damage that occurred here too. This, the roof of this building blew off. And I can guarantee you one thing, the floodwaters didn't reach up and pull it off there. It was the wind that did it. And so as a symbol of showing that, and we know from talking a lot of the first responders, and thank God for the first responders, the police and the firemen, uh, that a lot of the construction people that were here right afterwards, frankly, a lot of you volunteered, thank you, you know, to get back out here and start restoring the shore and saving us. They, they, they have a, a wealth of information and knowledge just for them because they were here. They were here as the storm was going on saving us. So we find getting witnesses, eyewitnesses mean an awful lot in the community getting up the evidence that we can prove how much wind damage happened so that you can get your insurance company to pay you what is truly owed. And I think that's the only thing people really look for is just to be treated fairly and with justice. And what Joey and Dolores you know, wanted me to get across to you today is don't give up. You have, re you have rights, but you also have rights to, to get together, it's the American way, to get together, to show a resolve so that the politicians in Washington, D.C. will hear you, the politicians in Trent will hear you, the media will be able to see it, that you're united as a community and you're not going to just take, take this laying down.